Don't you find it satisfying when the music perfectly ends at the end of your video? Here's how I do it using Adobe Audition. So let's say we want the song to end at the end of the intro of the video you just watched, which is seven seconds long. So first of all, let's download a song we want to use. Let's say we'll download this song from Epidemic Sound. All right, and then now if we go to Adobe Audition, you'll see something like this. If we right click into this window and click import and find it, it's here, cool. Now, if we right click on this panel and go insert into multi-track, new multi-track session, let's call it whatever we want, example, whatever. All right, cool. And then now if we go under properties, remix, enable remix, it will allow us to adjust the length of this song so it's any length we want. Let's say we want it for seven seconds. So it looks like the shortest duration is 10 seconds and it shortened it. So it's 12 seconds. Now let's zoom in and see it. Usually it tapers off at the end. So it can be a bit shorter than 12 seconds. So the last beat is at around 10 seconds, which is still a bit longer than our intro, but we'll find a workaround for this somehow. And these jagged lines show where they made the cut to make it shorter. All right, say that's all good. We'll go file, export, multi track, mix down, entire session, we'll put it under downloads. Okay, let's go under Final Cut Pro and then we'll go under downloads. Let's close this. Let's drag and drop it onto our timeline. And as you can see, it's longer than our intro, unfortunately. But let's try to find a workaround. Usually our clips or our video isn't just going to be seven seconds. So, you know, this isn't ideal as an example, but we'll find a workaround. So let's try to make at least the last beat end with the last word I say. So it's a bit late. Let's reduce the volume. So that's pretty good. Let's see what happens when I make this at the start. Don't you find it sad? Don't you find it sad? That's pretty good to be honest. Let's zoom in and see if we can just drag this so it fades in slightly. Don't you find it? Let's see what happens with when we cut out this beat. Don't you find it sad? That's pretty good as well. So let's let's try that and let's remove this extra space on the intro and let's see how that sounds don't you find it satisfying when the music perfectly ends at the end of your video here's how i do it using adobe audition all right that looks pretty good to me that sounds pretty good to me so that's how i do it with adobe audition my name is junius and i help people make and strategize educational content and i have playlists helping you with exactly that thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one